Red light cameras, you either love them or you hate them. At one point, they were all over the Bay Area. Now they're in just a few cities, including Tampa, where leaders there are promising to get rid of them. Nightside's Bo Zimmer is working on this story for you. Well, Carolina, in 2013, 10 News drew national attention to the city when we asked Police Chief Jane Castor why the cameras weren't going in the most dangerous intersections, but instead were placed in intersections that seemed to generate the most revenue. Well, today, candidate for mayor David Straz announced after watching those reports, he will ban red light cameras if elected mayor. What did you take away from that reporting? That they should be banned, very simply. It's a burden on the, on the backs of the less fortunate people, the, the uh, citations you get. And plus, uh, the people, the citizens, don't want red light cameras. Now, this was a hot button issue for the other candidates as well. Harry Cohen, Mike Suarez, and Jane Castor, they are all big believers that red light cameras make our intersections here in Tampa a whole lot safer. Now, the other candidates, they tell me that they feel like there might need to be some changes with Tampa's red light camera program, but David Straz, Ed Tranchik, and Topher Morrison, they all say they haven't seen enough evidence yet to convince them that red light cameras are actually working. They've also uh, expressed express concerns about the fines associated and they want those reduced or eliminated altogether. Now we are still waiting on a statement from Dick Greco Jr. But we've posted our interviews with each candidate and all of the responses received so far at WTSP.com.